forth whether we're going to see any more development overnight or not. And it does look like there's at least a good possibility that we are going to see at least more showers in some spots. Also, a lakeshore flood advisory in effect for Sanilac and St. Clair counties tomorrow. Winds are going to be coming out of the north and northwest, uh, and that's going to bring some possibility for, uh, for some lakeshore flooding, not from the rain, but from the uh, wind off of those high lake waters. Here's a look now at the forecast. This is one of the latest model data uh, updates that we've gotten in. Watch what happens overnight. We're starting to see more of those showers starting to form. Again, this is 6 a.m. as we start into the morning commute, so be aware as you head out the door. Not everybody's going to be wet tomorrow morning, but there is definitely the possibility we could be seeing some downpours. Getting into the uh, second half of Tuesday, things do start to dry up. There may be a couple showers or a rumble of thunder, especially in our south zone as we get into tomorrow afternoon. Most of tomorrow for the majority of us are going to be dry. Humidity is going to start out still on the uh, oppressive side or at least mu very muggy and then we'll start falling as we get through the day. 70 degrees tonight. Thunderstorms again with heavy rain, especially in some of those areas that we've outlined earlier. High temperatures tomorrow uh, going to go back to the low 80s, 82 in the city and Dearborn Romulus all at 82. Plus we still have that high humidity. It will be dropping late in the day, but we're probably not going to notice the difference until uh, later in the nighttime hours. 79 down in the south zone, a little bit more in the way of cloud cover there uh, with the uh, possibility of seeing those scattered showers and thunderstorms in the second half. 80s in the west zone and 70s in our north zone for high temperatures tomorrow. Getting into the seven day forecast, close call with a chance of a shower on Thursday. It looks like most of that's going to be west of us. So the primary uh, m most of the rest of the week, I should say, is going to be dry. But once we get into the upcoming weekend, more showers and thunderstorms, more humidity. We get a little bit of a break here late in the week. A little bit of rain at, at a time. That'll be nice for the lawns. If it was just a little. Right. Yeah. Right. Thanks, Ben. All right, a chaotic scene.